If a company makes a new version of an existing product, one hopes that their new model is better and addresses cons of the original. The Max is the newest addition to the lineup of three-sided Sonic toothbrushes from Triple Bristle. It looks good, but looks can be deceiving. In the time you should spend brushing your teeth, I will give you my opinion. Put two minutes on the timer, let's go. Normal toothbrushing means brushing each tooth surface for 1.25 seconds. It's not long, but long enough if you use the correct technique. Unfortunately, we don't always. Thus, a brush that cleans three surfaces simultaneously whilst positioning the bristles at the optimum angle has to be the answer. Yes and no. If you brush for the recommended two minutes, the results are very good, but not perfect and I have neatly aligned teeth. I actually achieve better results with a regular toothbrush. That said, if you brush for 40 to 70 seconds per day like the majority of people, then triple bristle is probably going to be a big help in gaining better results. The head is larger than most and you can feel it pushing on the soft tissues as you glide it along. It flexes well to the different size teeth. Some, including existing electric toothbrush users, will find it uncomfortable, possibly because it's cleaning better. Give it two weeks to get used to it. For those wondering, it is safe to use on crowns, bridges, implants, braces, veneers, and more. And I see little benefit to the charcoal infused bristles. The modern minimal design of the Max is a massive step up from the original. It feels slim and solid in hand. Up to 42,000 sonic vibrations per minute are available on the Max compared to the 31,000 of the original. There are now four modes, deep clean, gentle, sensitive and massage. Backlit icons on the handle show which is selected. It's hard to distinguish between them, particularly deep and gentle clean. You can't change mode until you power the brush on. There's a 30 second pacer and two minute timer built in. No pressure sensor unfortunately. The Max powers off automatically and produces up to 58 decibels of sound. The bulky charging stand has been replaced with a future-proof USB Type-C connector. Found hidden under a flappy cover on the base of the brush handle. I find this a bit more fiddly than a stand, but there's good flex in the cover, it's more travel friendly and you only need to access it about once a month. A USB type A male to USB type C cable and a USB charging brick are supplied. And an LED on the handle gives feedback on the charge status. The tongue is a common cause of bad breath, you need to clean it. Far too few do, therefore I really like the inclusion of the tongue scraper. Make do with the plastic caps provided to protect the bristles rather than buying the travel case separately. It's massive. The provided warranty is just one year. I would generally pick this over the original, it's about $30 more expensive at $100. Subscribe and you can save a bit. It's not much more expensive than a good regular electric toothbrush. If you've mastered your technique, there is little point in switching. But if you know you don't brush for long enough or have a less systematic brushing approach, the Max is worth considering. Links to buy the Max or recommended alternatives are available in the description.